Oh, do they have it in purple? <laughs> I guess they do. You know what happened was we, we found out through some testing around the house that purple is not my color, but too late. Now I don't give a fat fuck. I went to Utah this weekend and then I went to Palm Springs and went to an outlet mall and there was an alligator store and I haven't had an Isa Lacoste since I was like in uh, Scottsdale when I was a kid. So I had a big long tail on it. So I went there and there's a fucking line and it was boiling and it was 121 and no, but I waited in line and it was fucking boiling. I guess we covered that. Oh, and then The Wrong Missy, I just saw on Netflix, they released it. It's the, uh, well, look at my Instagram. I don't like to talk about it. It's really private, but I'll tell you, it's shocking news. Fuck you. <laughs> God damn. Sick of being Mr. Pop. Fauci, he was saying. <laughs> Fauci is good guy, bit of a buzzkill. On the cover of InStyle magazine. Why? I think he's wearing Oakley's. But I'm gonna let all that slide because he said, I just I just want him to be a little more on the top spin positive. Uh, obviously, we're all fucked. But he's like, I wouldn't play football, basketball, baseball, maybe foosball if gloves, standing away, don't look at each other, have zero fun, maybe a mini tramp. That's fun. I have one. I get 100 yards out in the yard and uh, I just jump up and down now and then throw in a herky. Herky! You know what herky is? Do you know what herky is? Mm -hmm. Cheerleader move. Leg out, one in. Bit of a jackknife situation. Mm -hmm. And I was a cheerleader in high school. I was top of the pyramid. Don't get me wrong. I got some uh, scoochie. You know what I'm talking about? You know, they called me Snatch Adams in med school. Some did. Anyway, long story short, germs are bad. The little Rolex got in there. <laughs> Fuck, my phone is so, and I know what it is. Uh, I did a Rolex joke. I did, oh, priest washing hands. Cardi B, vitamin C, busy B. <laughs> Busy Bee, Junebug's favorite toys, Busy Bee. Into the jokes. Everyone tunes out. You want me to turn it down, and I won't because I have to have the noises, which are so. How could I not do this? You want that gone? Wow. It's sickening. It's making me sick to my stomach because it's ruining my six out of 10 jokes that there are six out of 10 in quality. I'm gonna try one. I'm gonna try one, one full joke. Mike Tyson, he's gonna fight a shark for a new show on Shark Week. But before that, I'll have to face his toughest opponent yet. The S in shark. <laughs> I hope he doesn't bite his fin off. <laughs> Take that, shark. The thing about Mike Tyson is it's very nice and funny and um, we make fun of the way he talks. That joke premise has been around for ages. So why lose it? Here's another tired premise. Some classic movie props like Maverick's helmet from Top Gun are up for auction. Uh, it's in great shape and can still deflect rumors. Perf. Perf. <laughs> Dwayne Johnson overtook Kylie Jenner as the highest paid celebrity for sponsored posts on Instagram. He's the first person to actually keep up with the Kardashian and trash them up. It's a cute joke. It's more news. It's less funny. Justin Bieber posted on Instagram, he still can't believe his wife Haley chose him as her partner. Bieber's accountant said, um, I get it. Quarter, 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 quarter. I like Bieber. Gwyneth Paltrow said she's been using intermittent fasting to keep in shape during the lockdown. She says she got the idea from poor people. She said they didn't eat for a long time and then they were skinny and that caught my eye. The Real Housewives of Orange County resumed filming amid the pandemic. Doctors gave thumbs up after they realized they don't give a shit if they live or die. <laughs> That's mean. You think those ladies are loud now? Why do they have to yell at each other from six feet away? Woo! A new documentary featuring Former child stars talking about their struggle is coming to HBO Max. It's called Dickie Roberts. 
Why is no one referencing Dickie Roberts? That's what I was. I was a child star and I got into drugs and I lost my career and I tried to make a comeback. Fuck, it's, you know what? It's too real. It should be a Netflix doc. A woman in Austin quit her job to earn six figures a month acting like a dog on OnlyFans. <laughs> I'm not even going to do the joke because I just like the setup. I don't even get what she's doing. She acts like a dog on that porn thing, OnlyFans. She better be licking some nardules. I mean, what if just she sits like a dog, sit, stay, roll over? That's not enough. I'm not getting my nine ninety nine a month for that bull fucking shit. I'll tell you what. <laughs> A bar stopped selling beer because the bottle looked like a KKK hood. It still wasn't as white as ordering a Michelob Ultra. <laughs> New Jersey is stopping people from betting on Ukrainian table tennis because of corruption concerns. You gotta be really corrupt to be too much for New Jersey. Their slogan is the we didn't see nothing state. We didn't see nothing. Court documents revealed that Gislaine Maxwell is secretly married, but she refuses to name her spouse. The only clue she gave police is the name of the elementary school he goes to. <laughs> Home stretch. The president of Brazil, who's isolating because of corona, was bit by an emu. A wild emu. That's why whenever I'm isolating, I make sure my emo... Stays in the emu doghouse. <laughs> emu house. Fuck off. <laughs> why are these jokes? I think why do I even, why do I do it? <laughs> it has emu, which is a tricky one. <laughs> so tricky. No one could have done that joke. A pub owner in the UK installed an electric fence to keep customers six feet away from the bar. He said he got the idea from schools in Prince Andrew's neighborhood. Hello! <laughs> the Washington Redskins have been rocked by a number of Me Too allegations. Now the mascot on their helmet is just red from embarrassment. A scientist warned that seagulls are getting high by eating ants. How do you know if a seagull's even getting high? They fly away. Perfect noise. Uh, it's getting out of hand. Just the other day, a seagull offered me a jerk off for two fire ants and a bumblebee. <laughs> and he said, if I have a murder hornet, it's cock, cock, cock.